Hi, it's Dr. Wright again with Jen, a certified lymphedema therapist, and we're talking about lymphatics and we where we left off. When we left off last time, we told you a little bit about the lymphatic system and we told you when it sits there and it's not working properly, that it starts to cause a problem. So now what are we going to do about it? We got to get it into the lymphatics. And so it sits in the tissues in the interstitium and it's got to get into the, the lymph capillaries and it needs a little push. And Jen's going to tell us about how we give it that push. Okay. So there are many, many, many different ways. And if you might need to research what works best for you. So there has been several yoga classes that they have started doing that specifically do poses that will help stimulate the lymphatic drainage. There is also, when we're talking about yoga, let's talk about exercise in general. Exercise in general is one of the best things you can do for yourself, especially if you wear compression when you're doing your exercise. A lot of my people love to exercise in the water because you're automatically getting the pressure from the water and then exercising. Bada boom, two for one. Then there's some newer techniques out there. Some patients are using, or some therapists and some patients are using what they call dry brushing. This needs to be researched for the specific patient. If it is a cancer patient that has had lymph nodes removed, there is a caution that you could be causing micro tears. So that would be a caution. I know some of my lipedema patients do actually very well with it because it helps desensitize as they're doing it. Yeah. I know some patients have had some good success with it because the brush itself makes your reach a little more so you can reach areas that maybe you couldn't reach with just your mm -hmm. hand. Yeah. Um, Muscle pumping in general is one of the best things you can do. So some patients are now using also a vibration plate. That would be something you need to research too because vibration plates vary. There's like a $100 version that looks like a piece of paper and then there's a $1,000 version that looks like one of those old fashioned aerobic steps. The best thing you can do is get your doctor to refer you to a therapist because that therapist is gonna educate you, educate you, educate you. They're gonna give you a specific plan for you to stimulate your lymphatic flow through your pathways. And they're going to teach you how to massage your pump points. They're going to teach you how to do some manual lymphatic drainage on yourself, not to mention they will do that for you as well. And they can get you hooked up with some compression and they will teach you how to diaphragmatic breathe. Stay tuned for our next video. We'll teach you how to do that. Yeah. So once we get it, we're at our next video. We're going to talk about once we've gotten that push, it's into the lymphatics, how we make sure it goes all the way back into the circulation.